but no, I will also take yours. <laughs> I am Dennis. Uh, to my brother Riley for getting his pilot's license. So you and your friends came to this island for a vacation in paradise, yes? Let's go. <laughs> But now island thugs have captured your friends and plan to sell them into slavery. You want to rescue them? You want to escape this island alive? Then listen to me. I know a secret or two about this place. I will teach you. Welcome to Omanaki village. Native headquarters and home to the peaceful Rakiat people. Rook is an archipelago made up of many islands but there are two main ones. This is the North Island, now ravaged by the war between the native rebels and the filthy, sadistic pirates, led by Vas, the animal who killed your brother and took your girl. Did you want me to slice you open like I did your friend? The rebels have pledged allegiance to Vas's sister, the mysterious and exotic Citra. Her desire to save the island is, how you say? <sighs> Passionate. <laughs> but if you win her heart, you will win her warriors. Now, the South Island is ruled by a third faction, the Privateers, led by the infamous Hoyt. I roast you in the furnace until your skin crackles like chicken. His Privateers run your typical drug and slave trade operation. Do you know the real secret to keeping employees happy? Fear. Your very own island for the head of Jason Brody. There are many more power players in this jungle each with their own motives. So, be careful whom you trust. Once we start this, there's no going back. That is Sam, a junior G-man, and this is his covert partner, Willis, Rook's neighborhood spy. Get on their good side, and you will be rewarded with firepower. Get in. The endless jungle will take you many hours to explore and master, and even longer to conquer. Think of this wide open world as your oyster. But remember that every pearl comes at a price. Here, cash for weapons. Oh, uh... You want to save your brother, right? I've never shot anyone before. What do they say in America? There's a first time for everything. You will need a large arsenal of weapons to defeat enemies. Each is customizable to your fighting style. I find some machine guns effective for close quarters combat. One weapon won't get you very far. I use assault rifles for general purpose, shotguns to clear areas, and machine guns and rocket launchers, and C4 for incinerating vehicles. Bow and arrows can turn you into a silent assassin. Add flaming or explosive arrows to make your troubles melt away. Deliver death from a distance with a sniper rifle. Or turn up the heat with a flamethrower. Yes, I love this thing! Each weapon has many attachments and customization options. Try adding an illuminated scope to your Z93, a reflex sight to your MP5, or a suppressor to your assault rifle. You will thank me later. The art of war is all about improvisation, my friend. So you must learn the technique. Pick up killing skills like death from above and the grenade takedown, and you will make yourself a force to be reckoned with. The outposts are strongholds found throughout Rook Island. Vas's pirates hold them to control the surrounding area. So we're heading into a fight? Yes. Conquering the island requires a strategy. Climb the radio towers, hack the radio to expand the map, and locate outposts to take over. Taking outposts from the pirates is key to reclaiming the island. Once you've taken over an outpost, it becomes a safe haven for new missions and adventure. Rook Island's wildlife is unlike anywhere else in the world. 
with rare Galapagos tortoises, manta rays, and even Komodo dragons. But with more than 40 native species, some are higher up the food chain. Learn to fight sharks, take out jungle cats, and turn these predators against your enemies. Skin what you kill and trade the pelts for more weapons or ammunition. Remember, plant life here is just like the island. Lush, rare, and very deadly. Bend nature to your will to create potent formulas to help you survive longer. From remedies to recipes, you will need it all to succeed. You will want to meet the good Dr. Earnhardt. He's a bit of a mad scientist, but he knows what he is doing. I need a couple of minutes to prepare the medicine. Get his recipes and then gather ingredients to fill your syringes. Each syringe improves a different ability. A sharpshooter syringe increases accuracy when you shoot from the hip. A deep dive syringe helps you hold your breath longer underwater. Crafting is just one of many skills. You will learn more by earning XP and receive new warrior tattoos to display your new talents. The Heron is for long range attack skills. The Spider is for stealthy gorilla tactics. And the Shark for sheer brute strength. The choice is yours. Become a better shot, learn some chain takedowns, or master knife throwing to chalk up some impressive kills. Transportation is simply a matter of personal taste. Do you like big guns on your vehicle like these Jeeps? Maybe you like to bet on head-to-head -head jet ski races, or cause trouble in an armed Zodiac boat. Me, I like to get around quickly, so I prefer the hand gliders. You came to the island for extreme sports, yes? Well, now you can go zip lining, hang gliding, and skydiving. And once the sun goes down, your options for adult recreation can be rather interesting. There's a regular poker game in the back. You can challenge your enemies to a hand of poker. One finger every time you lose. Throw knives in cash prize competitions. Quench your thirst and maybe meet a pretty local lady in Bad Town. Hey, fucky, fucky, sucky, sucky. For the competitive set, Far Cry 3's multiplayer opens another massive world for up to 14 players. The action all takes place at another nearby island. The thrilling Firestorm mode requires each team to work together to burn their opponent's supply nodes. It's like capture the flag, but the flag is soaked in gasoline. You can use sight gas to disorient your enemies and keep them from telling friends from foes, so they'll kill each other with friendly fire. If your comrades find themselves in trouble, use the battle cry ability to improve the health, speed, and weapon accuracy of all your teammates within the radius. At the end of each battle, everyone watches while you punish the top player on the losing team. Or you can grant mercy to a worthy opponent. Thank you. Thank you. And for more focus, team-based play, the co-op mode can really bring the room together. Co-op mode is set on another island. A few months before you show up, four ship crew members with dark past have been sold to Vas, and they want payback on the captain who betrayed them. You can play in local split-screen mode with your companions, or go online with full four-player co-op. Now that's nice! You want to take back your freedom? Then choose one of six action-packed story chapters and make every bullet count. You will need to work together to take out your enemies. Each mission includes a competitive challenge to show off your skills, race quads, outsnipe your friends, or use RPGs for target practice on the coastline. But listen carefully, my friend. Nobody has ever escaped this jungle alive. So, you either learn to accept the risks or die like everybody else. You choose. Welcome to Rook Island. Shoot first, ask directions later. <laughs>